name is Zach, and when I was 15, I suffered a cardiac arrest. I'm alive today because my coach knew CPR and there was an AED at my school. I was at a basketball tryout for my school team when my heart stopped. When I got to the school after they told me he had collapsed on the phone, uh, we were met with paramedics. Um, they wouldn't let me in at first because they said he had no vitals. He went into cardiac arrest and collapsed onto the floor. Uh, and I asked my assistant coach, Ivan, to call 911. And I asked one of my players who was trying out Malachi to run and grab an AED machine. Uh, while Malachi was gone to get the machine, uh, I began chest compressions. And then when the machine arrived, I set that up and uh, used that until paramedics arrived. Uh, we later found out that it was actually his coach who um, began CPR and used an AED to restart his heart in the school gym um, before the paramedics arrived. From that very first night when we were in the ER um, and met with the doctors there who were trying their hardest to figure out what was going on with Zach's heart, um, we were told repeatedly from the ER doctors, the cardiologists, the staff in the ICU that had his coach not responded so quickly with CPR, we don't know where things would have turned for Zach that day. His heart essentially stopped. And until the paramedics could arrive, that CPR and using an AED is what made the difference to save his life. I don't really consider myself, they use the word hero a lot, I don't really consider myself a hero. I think I was just doing what anyone in that moment should have done. I think is what anyone should do in that moment and just do the best you can in that moment and hopefully it all works out. I think the incident has changed me quite a bit. It's made me realize how I need to appreciate the times that I have with either my friends, my family, and really to like appreciate every day that I have that I go through. I think if schools are considering starting a CPR program, that it should be the first thing that they do. I really believe it should actually be a mandatory program for all students, uh, easily connectable with grade nine or grade 10 phys ed. Uh, and so that's, I think it should be a priority in, in all schools. And I think every student in the building should know where an a the AD machine is. I definitely encourage people to learn CPR because it could happen to a family member, a friend, it could happen to anyone around you. And it's very vital and important to know it and know how to do it so you can save a life.